We do a lot of free education mm. at, at Slipways because that baseline of, of education is lacking and it's not just an Australia problem. And, and look, that's, a, that's what we do with a lot of slipways, you know, yeah. when we're dealing with trades is let's educate you a little bit. So when you lift mm -hmm. a boat and you see this kind of activity, yeah. what's my next natural step yeah. Yeah. to make sure that we either fix it properly, mm -hmm. notify the customer, yeah. this is what's going on so we don't have this big blow up of mm. what's going on and the headless chook mentality, mm. or let's engage the professionals. Let's find out what's going on so that mm. we can best help you because the last thing we want to do as your shipwright or whatever mm. they might be, is grind it, paint it, put it in the water and have this happen again. Mm and potentially have this exacerbate and get worse. And so um, being supportive to the industry is incredibly important. This is a global problem that the baseline of education about corrosion, just making that distinguishment between electrolysis yeah. and stray current yeah. and it's hot and it's an anode problem or if it's over zincing or, you know, and yeah. so we really break it all down. What, yeah. it, what are you actually looking at here? Or the other thing is, let's not sugarcoat this we've yeah. got something major going on and we need to get to the bottom of yeah. it and so that yeah. little bit of information goes a really long way and we've got the job there to be the industry professionals and support these people so that the boat owner whoever they might be from you know the 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 nine meter tinny up to super yacht we're existing in that space because all, it's all very similar problems just on different scales